Welcome back everybody, so today we're looking at Roku. Yes, we are setting up a Roku stick, straight step-by-step -step guide on how to set it up and get it working straight out to the box. So we're not going to show you how to set up a one out of the box, it's really simple, plug it in, plug it in the back of your TV and then you get to this screen. Before we get going though, if you can, do remember to hit that subscribe button, we cover everything streaming here and we're now going to be covering weekly videos on our Roku devices as well, as well as Fire Stick and Android TV. So, do check out the rest of the channel and do stay tuned for many good Roku videos if that's what you're watching for. So, we're going to do step by step and obviously we're going to need your remote. So get your remote, get the batteries in it and then let's get started and let's do it. So it's simple, we select your language, for me is English. Then we're going to be connecting to our internet, so I'll select my internet and then I will enter my password. I'll quickly do that while you're not looking. Okay, I've entered my password and once you've done your password for your internet, you hit on connect. It will then check your connection and it will connect. If it doesn't connect, the main reason will be you've entered your password incorrectly. So please check that password is typed correctly with the correct casing as well. Okay, so now we're connected. We're gonna go through all the updates it needs. So make sure you click okay and get your device up to date. We're going to race through that part and we'll be back in a second. Okay, you will get this message when it's up to date. We click continue. Check remote settings. So check remote settings. This is about setting up for your TV and your TV brand. So do type in your TV brand. Um, I'm actually on a monitor, but I will put it in there. So I'll put in HP. Okay. Um, I'm going to say yes, but I can't actually tell because I'm on a monitor only. So you have to listen out for the monitor and listen out for the music. Okay, so we're all set up now. Volume on the consigned, so you've got that. So you click OK. So now we need to enter an email address or log into a Roku account if you already have one. So I'm going to set up a fresh one. So I'm going to do that quickly now for you. I click continue. I have to obviously check my inbox now. You will then get your email through as you'll see and you just click activate device. And then we obviously have to name your device and which room you're located in. So I'll just put this one in office. Streaming stick 4K is fine for me. I've read the terms and conditions and I'll click continue. You can then set up Roku Pay. Um, this is if you want it for, if you want to purchase it via your device, whether it's subscriptions or anything like that. For now, I'm going to skip this step because I just want to use the free device. Do you pay for cable or satellite TV? I'm going to say no. Do you currently subscribe to any of these services? I will click the ones I do. Um, there, click continue. And you can put in any interest you might have. So for me, I would put in free movies and TVs is obviously the main thing I want. I don't mind a little bit of local news. And that'll do. We click continue. Add more channels to your Roku home screen. So you can add these while you're here. So personally, some of these free ones are great. Pluto's always a must. Um, Tubby for me is a must. Tubi, however you say it. Your choice on this one. Um, at the moment, I'm going to stick with just those. Click continue. And back to my Roku stick, and I didn't have to click anything else. This happens automatically. Now it's updating all the channels we just did via that email, okay? Nice and easy. And we'll get through this bit quickly. And all done. We can click OK. Let's get you and we're into our Roku device. And here you've got your home, your live TV, watch to watch, featured, everything like that. And the settings, which I'm gonna go through in another video soon on everything you need to turn off to make the best of the device. Um, and loads of other things you can do here, okay? So if you wanted to find those apps, if you go to your home screen, we added these on there. You will need to log into your account if you have one of these, but something like um, Tubi is a free app. Great to use, nice and simple, everything like that. Obviously, a lot of applications are geo-locked or geo-based, so you need to be in certain countries to use them. 
But again, all this content is free within here. It's a great watch. Um, it's good to get used to. Again, you can exit if you want to. You can sign into Tubi. Pluto's got tons of content again. And many, many others. We will show you more customization as we go on this throughout the next few weeks. Um, again, you can accept this for Pluto. This one does play automatically. So let me just get us out of there before we get any copyright strikes on YouTube or anything like that. So you've got a few other things on there. We will be going through this very, very soon. Brilliant. Hopefully, hopefully you enjoyed that. Hopefully that was good for you. Um, remember to hit that subscribe button. Um, we've got tons of stuff on the channel for you. Like I say already, hopefully it was really useful. We've got links underneath if you're after any VPNs or follow me on my socials. And we've got a Discord channel as well if you need any help. Thank you for watching. Hope that was good for you and I'll see you all soon. Thank you.